And here we go with Shy Smith deep for the Gamecocks. It will be a touchback and come out to the 20th of here. Third down and seven, his first pass of the day, taking a shot downfield, juggling, and unable to. They rush four and third and nine. Nix finds a receiver who's wide open, got behind the defense. Got to get the passing game going a little bit. Nix again off play action, and it's complete to Seth Williams, who is their top receiver. He doesn't drop anything. Interesting, but it's going to work out for Auburn in the long term. Another pass play here for Nix, although using his feet here, trying to get the first down, and he was able to do it. Boy, the defender. Here's Bixby being chased, but gets the first down to the 20-yard line. Pickup of five there. Two on third down against that great third down defense. Schwartz trying to get outside, but runs out of room. Seconds left last week. And here he is from 35, getting Auburn on the board. An impressive drive pickup. Nix will throw again, and it's caught for a first down. True freshman Xavion Capers inside. 16th play, and on the pitch, Nick setting the block for Stove, who's inside the 30, and finally brought down inside. inside. Here's Bixby trying to cut it to the outside, breaks a tackle. Wow, Bixby all the way to the 10. Well, that's an eight corner. Third down and 10. Nix caught. Touchdown. Eli Stowe with his second Eli touchdown Stowe catch of the season. Great first quarter on offense for Auburn. Jay Pegues running the Wildcat, and he pitches it here to Grant Loy, who's the backup quarterback. Loy's pass to the end zone is incomplete. Auburn backed up. Nicks from his end zone, rolling to his left, and able to dump it off to Schwartz. And the speedster. Get On third and 11, Nicks in trouble. Escapes. Now Nicks throws into traffic, and it's intercepted. There's J.C. Horn again making a play. I mean, he's been all over Seth Williams throughout the day, and he gets a huge pick here. But it's the biggest story in college football today. Second and six. That pass is caught for a first down by Shai Smith. He hung on to that one after dropping a pass on with a hand injury. Hill dumps it off. Harris got the first down. On a, a good conversion. Harris again keeps the feet moving, driving, and is into the end zone for the touchdown. So the interception by Bo Nix turned into points. Horn took it away, and Harris took it in. And we'll see. It didn't seem like he was there. And you see the ball breaks the plane. The seeming direction of the game. Extra point is good, and it's not. Instead, it's a design quarterback run with Nix getting the first down. Good open field. Bo Nix, freshman of the year in the SEC a year ago, throws a deep ball here. Jump ball, and it is caught. And there. Here's Bixby straight ahead. And Bixby runs through defenders down to the one yard line. The ball came out. It's recovered by Jones, but they're going to rule the running back down at the one for the Tigers. And Bixby walks into the end zone for the touchdown. So the true freshman answer from the Auburn offense after the turnover. A lot going on right there. Only one yard to game it. They got jet sweep going to the left. They got possible quarterback run as well. But no, they'll just hand it to Tank Bigsby. Other than the turnover, the best Auburn has looked offensively. Maybe he couldn't get his own name when we went through the, the draft picks. <laughs> he forgot where he was picked as uh, Bo Nix. <laughs> Nix looking, everybody covered, takes off, makes a nice move to get the first down, and then slides. Third down and five. Nix from empty, 
Moving around. Flips it into traffic again. And it's picked off again. Intercepted by Jalen Dickerson. He comes up big here for South Carolina. Catching the ricochet and giving the ball back to the game. Six times already. Three catches. Hill looking for Smith. He's got it. A first down. Who's a transfer from Colorado State. They're going to run behind him. Fenwick has a first down to the 23-yard line. Running back. Hill. And the pass is caught by Van. Makes the defender miss. Van has a first down. It'll be first and goal. Quarterback keeper Hill on second and goal pushes his way toward the goal line and in for the touchdown. Two going for one. 16 14, Auburn. Hey everybody, I'm Wheels. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. All right, enjoy the second half highlights. The official. Was it though? I, maybe that was the wrong replay there as uh, the Stove has the first down. I mean, maybe it happened early. Four on four. That's DJ Williams in the backfield. Nix moving outside the pocket, long throw, and near the first down is a throw though on the sideline. They'll run Williams here, up the middle. Runs through defender. Here's Carlson. He nails it, and Auburn's lead is five. Do what they call here in third down and five. They're going to keep it on the ground, and it's a huge running lane. And then, wow, Harris runs over Smoke. Playing the run game. How about Harris finishing that run, too? Here's the backup. Fenway inside the 10. It'll be first and goal. Second and goal outside the 10 now. Hill with a flag down. Oh, Shai Smith up the ladder, pulls it in for touchdown. Hill rolling to his right, looking. There was a lot of contact as Shai Smith Got shoved out of bounds. He and Smoke Monday having words, but it's incomplete. South Carolina does have the lead. Done what happened in the Arkansas game last week and how badly they got beat by Georgia. Here's a reverse on a trick play. And out of bounds to carry on. Georgia gets some big hitters. He's got a lot of speed, too. Play fake here for Hill on the rollout. Dumps it off to the fullback. First down catch. Prentice finally goes down by the fullback. Pressure coming late. Hills pass tip and a diving interception by Papo. Big play by the Auburn defense to get a takeaway in the red zone. <laughs> Snap to Nix. Sidearms it and it's picked off by J.C. Horn taking it back with a second interception of the game. J.C. Horn stepping in front of Williams. Excellent play on the ball. Kevin Harris running it left and running it in. Touchdown, South Carolina. And on the very next play, the touchdown followed by the number 13. Four man rush by Auburn. Here's a shot downfield, single coverage. Smith. Oh One-handed, ripped it in. I can ensure a good play action, throw it deep. Instead, they just hand it off to Fenwick, but he gets the first down easily. They are starting to lean on from about 45 and in. And right on cue, puts it through. We're going to start this drive of the run play. Bigsby past the 35 down the sideline, able to break a tackle and finally knocked out. Auburn offense try to create more separation. Play fake here for Nix and wide open in the middle of the field is Capers down to the 26 yard line. When they just go mono e mono press man and they haven't been getting separation. Big hole for Bigsby inside the 15. Keeps his balance somehow. 
So they're with an eight. Keep in mind, they had a botched two point conversion here on third and one. Give it to Harris and breaks a tackle. Gonna be close. No timeouts left for Auburn, and they will run it down to about the 44 as a shoe goes flying. Nick's to throw on first down. Long pass toward the sideline. A diving catch. Nix in trouble gets out of there. Nice move at the 40 and Nix tripped up. He was out on the field how quickly Charlotte Sanders got there. A flag down Nix rolling out throws back across the middle caught by Stove at the 35 and 32 in the clock. Nix bouncing around in the pocket steps up takes off. He's got running room. All the way down to the 18 yard line. Nix time is running out a flag is down and Nix running the ball he's tackled at the nine no time left let's see what the penalty is though personal foul hands to the face offense number 71 the ball carrier is short of the line of the game that penalty is declined.